Junior did the cross member today. That's satin. It'll it'll sheen down. So he did good. He did the whole bottom of it like two weeks ago. And today he did the top. So good to go. I'm moving. There you go guys. It's just an etch. Everything's maxed off. There you go, coat one. I put three on there. It's covering decent. Still a little stripy. But I think uh, three should do it. Nice. I love playing. There you go, coat two. It's starting to even out. The yellow is a very light pigment. So, should look good. I think people will notice it. Okay, it's coat three. That's good enough for me. Let's let it sit for a little while and put some stripes on it. Well, there you go, guys. Oof. It's staying, but I'm not sure if I like it. So, um, yeah. So we pretty much masked everything off that shouldn't have been painted, and we didn't paint it. So, 95% of this thing you're not going to see. You'd be lucky if you see the rim of the bell housing if you're up top. Uh, you'll see it if you look underneath. So it is what it is. They had some signature, let me tell you. Um, one thing I'm disappointed in is I should have put their parts in. Uh, I didn't have enough of their parts to do what I just did, but I had enough of their parts to do everything, uh, meaning clutches, bands, and stuff like that. You know what I mean? I even had the lever. So I just didn't want to mismatch their lever with the adjustment that I had here. But I'd open up the kit to read what their adjustment was. That's why I didn't use it. So maybe down in the future, we'll build a rear, a real vintage Fairbanks unit. So I'm not sure what year they went out and what year they switched over to what they are now. Uh, but it's cool. So it is what it is. Like I said, the couple of units I've seen, there's no rhyme or reason to the the striping on it. So that's what we went with. That's what we're leaving. So Junior likes it. That's all that matters. So now we just got to get the little pieces on. We got to get the. Uh, neutral safety switch on, we got to get the levers on for the uh, throttle lever and the shifter we got to get the speedo thing back in um, I'm gonna clean up that old mount and put it on see if that lands where I have to be or if maybe I could take the mount off the 904 see if that lands where I have to be because supposedly those holes to the bell housing are in the same spot on a 904 so it would be gold if this thing fell into place in all three corners <laughs> 